Let's make a hyper techno song. First let's set the tempo to somewhat around 150 BPM. And add some punchy kicks. Then I'll layer a techno kick on it. After the first 8 bars, let's add some claps. And let's make a bass line. Let's sidechain this. And add some EQ. I'll layer another bass to fatten this sound up. And let's layer a sub bass now. I'll sidechain this, and add some EQ. Now, let's make a piano melody for the drop. For that I'll load up Grand Piano from Direct Wave. I'll sidechain this. Add some EQ. Some reverb. And some saturation. Since the piano feels lacking, I'll layer another piano from the 4 Fonts True Pianos plugin. Now let's add some chords. I'll just side chain it. Now, let's loop this for another 16 bars and start working on the second half of the drop. Let's add some hi hats. Some rides. and some crashes. Hey, then let's add a vocal. Do you know what's on my mind? Do you know? 
Let's track this to a mixer channel and add some reverb. Then let's add some pads for tension. Guys, since the drop is now done, let's start working on the intro, the break and the buildup. I'll add the chords from the drop without side chaining. And add the vocals. Now let's make a bass line using a Reese bass. And let's add some arps. Guys, to make these arps more interesting, I'll automate the cutoff within the synthesizer. Don't forget some exhausts when transitioning into the breakdown. Here in the break, I'll add the piano melody without side chaining. And put the vocal under a cutoff filter. Finally, let's add some risers to build it up. So guys, our track is finished. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel, and let's see our final result.